Hey guys, my name is Raja Mizan and I'm the module leader for management and cost accounting. The purpose of this video is to introduce you to myself and to the module. This video is very important to understand how the module works, so please keep watching. I am teaching at UWE since 2012 and before that I was teaching at University of Derby and before that I was teaching um, in London. Now before that I was actually working as an accountant, um, so I worked as an auditor in the past. Uh, currently apart from teaching full time at UWE I am also running my own accountancy firm RMR Accountants and Business Advisors so I do do some work in practice as well. Coming back to this module, uh, this module is uh, an introductory management and cost accounting module. You don't need to have any background knowledge uh, on this subject. So we'll start from the ABC of management and cost accounting. Looking at the structure of uh, this module, uh, this module has uh, three study units. Uh, one is on, on working capital management. And uh, some of it uh, you will have seen already uh, while you were studying financial accounting in the previous modules, either in year two or in year one. So we'll start from that. That's our starting point. Then we'll move on to costing, which is uh, understanding the basics of cost. And then uh, we will uh, move on to the budgeting, um, budgeting area. This module will be taught uh, via one lecture, one lectorial and uh, one tutorial per week. Um, all of the uh, lectures and lectorials are unfortunately are pre-recorded um, due to COVID. So you will have to watch those videos. These videos are going to be um, a one hour, around one hour long, but uh, I may be um, uh, giving you those videos. Uh, in smaller bits rather than giving you a full one video of 50 minutes. So you must watch these uh, videos which will be released every Sunday uh, before the week starts and then you must watch them uh, before you go to your tutorial. I will be teaching all of the lectures and lectorials and uh, my colleague Andrew Baber he will be conducting all of the um, tutorials. These tutorials will be online live so you will join in on Blackboard Lectures are designed to give you a background on the topic uh, on theoretical areas. So we are discussing those theoretical areas and maybe part of the video will actually deal with some numbers as well. Uh, lectorials are going to be mostly number based. So I will be uh, solving uh, a scenario based question, which is not going to be like your exam questions, but uh, they are there to give you a bigger picture of the problem and the tutorial. We will only teach you exam type questions from the core textbook and I'll come back to the core textbook um, later. The tutorials will give you a really good um, uh, insight of how the exam questions are going to look like, the level of difficulty and so on. Actually, uh, many of the lectorial questions would be part of the uh, exam question bank from where we will generate your exam. So the core text uh, for this module is uh, is the book by uh, Catherine Gothop. I have this and obviously I'll, I'll show you the picture uh, on the screen as well. Business accounting and finance by Catherine Gothop. This is the fifth edition. Luckily, I managed to uh, get a discount code for you for you guys, which is 30 percent off the link uh, you can see on the screen. And it is also available um, on the module handbook. Uh, and I will make an announcement on that. So please make sure that you buy this uh, book as soon as possible. I can understand if you don't have it in the first couple of weeks, but you cannot really continue this module without this book. This is one of the issues we are having with the distance learning that uh, we have to rely um, on the on the core textbook. And this is a very effective way of learning. We talked about assessment. There are two assessments for this module. The first one is your uh, exam, which will be conducted in May. So that is a bit far. And uh, this assessment, this exam will be um, MCQ type questions, two hours long, 50 questions you will have to attempt. And uh, this will be uh, mostly the questions we, which we have dealt with uh, in the tutorials. Uh, and, and similar questions. The coursework is the one which is coming first. Um, so the coursework is 40% uh, of the total marks for this module. It's a report, individual report, which needs to be written 2,000 words long. 
and you need to submit it by 24th of March 2021. So it's like six weeks after we start our this module. So uh, it's important that you start from the very first week on this coursework to get really good marks. And to help you with that, um, we, uh, the first two weeks are actually on the topic, which is coursework related management of working capital. Uh, so the first two weeks are really, really important that you attend and you actually give it thought. So we will give you a good a start with your coursework and uh, plenty of guidelines will be given. Uh, the second class is actually on the coursework briefs, which you must not. Obviously, it's a video you cannot miss, but you must watch it. And then um, further videos will be available to help you to get with uh, get going with the number crunching again. You know, OCC, Alpha, Marks and Spencer. Uh, this is a very useful video which you can use. If you're watching this video, then I'm sure that you have access to Blackboard. It is very important to go through the contents of Blackboard. All of the contents for the module may not be available at the moment, uh, but I'm building the, those up. So very soon you'll be able to see everything which is relevant to your module. But uh, make sure that you uh, go through the module info section. So there's a detailed session plan is there as well, which you can see. Main teaching contents are available in the study unit section. So make sure uh, it's all uh, divided by weeks. Uh, first, it's divided by study units. There are three study units. And then in each study units, you will, you will see, for example, in the first study unit, uh, working capital management, you will see two weeks worth of material. And in those two weeks, you'll see for lecture, lectorial and tutorial. So it is worth exploring the Blackboard properly. There will be plenty of information on assessment. There's a separate section on the Blackboard uh, called assignments. And in there, I will be posting uh, plenty of information on the course, what you have to do. Uh, so uh, keep watching the videos. Any questions you can ask me on um, uh, via email. And actually, I will be creating a discussion board uh, which you can use to um, uh, po post your questions there. Discussion uh, board is actually better than sending me an email because uh, once you send me an email, uh, other students can see your questions and which will help them as well to, to learn more. So that's all for now. Um, I will be sending you more videos on the, uh, on the Blackboard. So keep watching. Uh, thank you for watching this video and keep going, guys. I know it's tough, but uh, we'll get through this. And I hope that you get really good marks in my module uh, as uh, as previous students have, have got. So we are here to help and um, good luck.